You've seen them depicted in TV shows and movies, but now futuristic robots and cars were finally unveiled by Elon Musk. The Tesla CEO launched his new line of technology during an announcement called We Robot, which features a self-driving vehicle and a humanoid robot. The tech mogul says the goal is to incorporate an autonomous future, one that will allow society to get their time back. Jason Gaidola joins us live tonight with more details. Good evening, Jason. Good evening, Manisa. Musk says some of the technology could be available as early as 2026 and claims it may cost somewhere between 20 to $30,000 for either a robot or an automated vehicle. However, questions do linger about the safety and viability of the products. Greeted with hyped up cheers, Elon Musk was front and center to showcase his company's automated future. So I hope this goes well. <laughs> In an event called We Robot, the Tesla CEO and tech mogul unveiled his newest technology, which includes his self driving vehicles and a humanoid robot called Optimus. You're really going to have something spectacular, something that anyone could own. Um, so you can have your own personal R2-D2 C-3PO. Musk and his team trotted out several of its black and white life-size machines, which gained traction online. The Tesla bots use the same AI from its vehicles and its capabilities include responses to human interaction and performing everyday tasks. I'll have a, uh, <laughs> Musk also introduced his long-awaited automated vehicles, known as the Robotaxis, or Cybercabs, an AI-powered vehicle that does not have a steering wheel or pedals. There was nothing in the very brief description or demonstration by Tesla that, that shows any significant leap in technological development or commercialization. However, the fun display left many questions regarding safety, reliability, and more details regarding its pricing. Musk says some of the tech should be available before 2027 and gave both items a soft price value of up to $30,000. And Tesla has played a very important role in electrification. But when we're talking about specific promises and timelines, and especially regarding automated driving, um, we have just more of the same, which is wait for next year, by next year, within a year, within a few years. It also appears to provoke a little anxiety for investors who see other automakers deploying similar technology right now. Out on the market are Google's former self-driving vehicle, Waymo, and GM's cruise vehicle. Both companies face controversies after its vehicles were involved in vandalism and crashes.